the God skeptic and the reality skeptic are really no different uh, from, from an epistemology point of view. Epistemology is how do I know what I know? Okay, how do I acquire true knowledge? So from an epistemology point of view, the idea of looking at whether my beliefs are justified or not, the atheist says, prove to me God exists. The solipsist says, prove to me that you exist. Both of them have already defined proof in a way that they will never accept the conclusion. What constitutes proof? Who gets to decide? Do you have a co coherent system of establishing knowledge? How would you recognize proof if you saw it? These are not questions that are contemplated or considered. And so, you know, when people ask, uh, does the Quran address the phenomenon of atheism? The Quran actually doesn't, uh, doesn't address it at a, at a superficial level. It addresses what's the root of it, which is skepticism, radical skepticism. And so the issue is not that there isn't a proof that, that the atheist has found that's convincing for the existence of God. The issue is that we haven't made our minds open to the, to the proofs. We haven't, we haven't, we haven't acquired the proper epistemology to recognize the signs of God.